Hamishy. Now this morning in home design, Hamish has brought along a friend. Morning. Good morning. That's right. I'd like to bring a friend along. I've brought Matt Pike and he is from Sanders and he's going to have a little chat to us about something we all run out of, which is space. Oh, yes. Morning. Yeah. Good morning, Matt. Great to have you on the show. Um, he's brought a good friend today. <laughs> now, what have you got for us to help solve the problem of lack of space? Right, so Sanders uh, manufacture and install a range of studios and cabins as well as garden sheds. So they basically uh, start at 10 square metres and work their way down to a small as you like cabin for putting in garden tools and implements. Really? So you can do skinny ones as well? We can do skinny ones and fat ones any size you like. You can do skinny ones that would fit between a fence and a garage where somebody's tried to build themselves a dodgy <laughs> shed before? If I can find a skinny enough installer to fit through there, yeah, Good. sure. Just like to clear these things up. So what are people using them for? So mostly they're used for um, extra space for storage. But uh, our 10 square metre buildings are able to be lined and insulated and have power into them. So they can be used as a home office, a hobby room, a gym or even just to throw your kids in there when they're making too much noise. I think the throwing the kids in there is an ideal thing to do with them. I've got three boys, they would, we would all do very well for them to have one of these. Yep. <laughs> what, what sort of styles have we got? What, how, what, so, what can I get it to look like? Our basic range is board and batten, but we can customise to suit. So if you wanted a rustic weatherboard, we can do that for you. Um, the, the, the cabana range is a um, cottagey type look. And then we go through the garden shed range, which is a basic square box or a, a um, or, a, or a gable roof. Yeah, and the good thing is with some of these is that you can put a bed in it. It can become a, an outdoor uh, room for the kids during the day. Well, you could certainly try that. Yeah, yeah Mal would love that. <laughs> you go and spend the day out in the shed. OK, what about installation? Is that difficult? So the sheds are delivered in a kit set flat pack. And the next day the installer will turn up and carry the bits and pieces around the side of the house and build it from the floor up and it should take you know, no more than a day for a standard size shed. Because that's the thing, isn't it? You want somewhere in your garden where you can store, because we've all got too much stuff, so store stuff that's going to stay nice and dry, because that's the thing I have with um, maybe people who build their own sheds, not particularly well at home. <laughs> you, you, everything in there gets wet and there's no point in it. Yeah, so all our timber sheds are, um, are lined and they all, have, um, uh, they all have a nice dry appearance to them, so there's no water tightness issues at all. Awesome. So if we want to find out more? Uh, go to sanderspremier.co.nz. Uh, or you can call us directly on 0800 12 22 32. And you know when you look at I guess the, the housing market around the country, a lot of people buy houses and the one thing that they forget to check is storage. Then they move everything in, then they run out of room. And they've got precious memories that they want to keep in a safe place. Would these sheds be perfect? Absolutely, yep, absolutely perfect. They're as dry as a bone. And yeah, you're absolutely right. The um, storage today is, is limited in a lot of the new housing that's getting built. And there's a lot of people with beach places that are growing with families and they don't want to put another room on the house at a cost of a fortune. They mm. just want to put a bit of a extra space there. Exactly. That'll save you a bit on the renovation, wouldn't it? it yeah, surely yeah. would, yeah. And how long does it usually take to get one of these sheds designed? So basically from the time you place your order to installation, it's between four to six weeks. Oh, nice. And okay, so how long does it take to put them up? <laughs> well, if it's a fully lined and insulated model with electrics, probably three days. Um, otherwise, it's more, no more than a day. OK, Matt, I need you to recap for me, because you started at the top of the show. Did you mention electricity? Just yes. take me through the basics again. So yep. they come with what? So we, we can sell you a kit set that has um, no lining or insulation or wiring, but then to, to an upgrade you can have um, all of those three things added in, so you end up with a nice compact little room, nice and warm, ready yeah. to be used. Yeah, that looks great. That looks is, nice. Is the veranda included in the 10 square metres? It is, yep. yep. No, well, nice. the building's 10 square metres and, and the rent is, is allowed, to be, is allowed to be extra. Yep. Yeah. Cool. So you'd want to have electricity in there if you've got children in there for their playstations and stuff. Mm -hmm. You can hook up the Wi-Fi and a whole <laughs> lot of other things that come into it. Or a room for mum and dad to escape and watch their favourite TV oh, show right, away from everybody else. The kids yeah. go in the outdoor <laughs> rooms and the kids cave. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> nice work. Well, that okay. sounds excellent. Yeah, it's been a pleasure having you on, Matt. Good yeah. friend, Hamish. I know, I did Good well friend. this week, didn't I? did do well.